This is all mods, A.K. Crooklyn. Um, I added some more world model animations um, for the uh, blast attack, the spirit bomb, and uh, the effect that um, plays, and the animation that plays when you shoot the Kamehameha and the ten times Kamehameha. Um, I'm gonna change this charge animation um, just a little bit because it don't look right looping. And I'll have Goku's mouth actually move when he's charging. And when you shoot the regular Kamehameha, the effect's not going to go the right way because I got this script on so I can do this. Um, but the animation will still play. The effect just ain't going to go the right way. Um, I still have to add the first part of audio to this. But here's the 10 times Kamehameha when you fire it. And this is uh, the, the spirit bomb that the player will have all the time when you actually get it. And I actually uh, made the mouth move with the audio on this one. Let me have some of your energy. Let me have some of your energy. Which I gotta take one little jaw movement out because it's slightly off. Let me have some of your energy. And when you get the nuke, um, you'll get this longer one. The person that gets the nuke. I have to follow the spirit of the planet now. And all its creatures. Please let me have some of your energy. And when he sticks his hand out forward, it'll be when it hits the ground. And I still have to add the rest of the audio to the back of it. And uh, make it so his uh, mouth moves with that audio. I had different audio there, so I had switched it. why so his mouth ain't moving with the audio that's playing now. It was moving with the old audio. I have to follow the spirit of the planet Namek. And all its creatures... But I will have the spirit bomb form over his head. Um, I'm sh still not sure if I'm going to spawn a model and do it that way or just do it all uh, strictly scripted without spawning a model to make it hit the ground. So I haven't decided how I'm going to do that part yet. Um, but I still got a lot more animation and attacks I'm going to add. And I'm thinking about making the weapon switch kind of like a mod menu type deal. Um, where you actually go in a little menu to switch your weapons and whatever ones you got unlocked will show up. Um, but other than that, um, that's pretty much it. Let me have some of your energy. Let me have some of your energy.